Hello guys and welcome to another episode of Nugget of the Day. In this nugget we learn how to draw the lumbar plexus the easy way. Uh, it's a very common question to expect uh, to know how to draw brachial plexus but if we can remember the lumbar plexus our jobs becomes easier. So the lumbar plexus mainly constitutes of the uh, lumbar roots L1, L2, L3 and L4 with a variable contribution from T12 and uh, giving a small contribution to L5 as well. So the way I remember is, is to remember the mnemonic, I invariably uh, get lazy on Fridays. So I'm going to write that down on the right hand side of the screen. Uh, and that will give me the six main nerves that come from this uh, lumbar plexus. So the first I standing for iliohypogastric nerve. Now remember the uh, hypogastric area is above the inguinal area. So iliohypogastric lies above the ilioinguinal nerve, which is the second I. Uh, G standing for genitofemoral nerve. L standing for lateral femoral cutaneous nerve or the lateral cutaneous nerve of the thigh. O standing for obturator nerve and F standing for femoral nerve. So that gives me the six uh, main branches of the lumbar plexus. Next I need to remember that two nerves come from one single nerve root, two nerves come from two nerve roots and two nerves uh, come from three nerve roots totaling six nerves as we've written on the right side. So the first uh, double which uh, comes from a single nerve root is the iliohypogastric and ilioinguinal nerve both of them coming from the L1 nerve root. Next L1 and L2 combine to give origin to the genitofemoral nerve. Next L2 and L3 combine to give origin to the lateral femoral cutaneous nerve. And the last double is from three nerve roots. So L2, L3 and L4 combine to give origin to the obturator nerve. And again branches from L2, L3, and L4 combine to give origin to the femoral nerve. It's very important to remember which divisions these are. So lateral femoral cutaneous nerve is a dorsal division, obturator nerve is the ventral division and the femoral nerve again is a dorsal division. So I remember that as DVD. The L1 nerve root receives a small innervation from T12 and L4 gives a very small contribution to the L5 which constitutes the lumbosacral trunk and that's your lumbar plexus. Now we need to remember the nerve root. So iliohypogastric comes from L1 T12, ilioinguinal from L1, genitofemoral from L1 L2, lateral femoral cutaneous nerve from L2 L3 and obturator and femoral both from L2 L3 L4. So that is it guys. <laughs>